Hi everybody, it's Santi Savvy here. I wanted to show you the things that I bought today. Sorry, you see my, this is a different thing holding my phone, but I just, it's just what I did. So I went to Omer de Serre today and I bought a few things and I'm really excited. Um, and I here, I'm gonna show you. So I got a Koi watercolor paintbrush and it's a small petit. And um, I already cut it open. And I'm really excited about this. You take this thing off and you screw this on. It's screwed on the opposite way so that when you when you write it twist it's not going to twist off while you're painting. And look at this tiny beauty. You know, I'm really happy about that. Tiny for eyelashes for detail. I also got Windsor Red Deep. This was like $21. I uh, you know, I invested this is the last forever. Um, because I have this, it's called Crimson Hue, and I wanted Crimson Red, but this has a pink tint to it, and that's not what I wanted. <clears throat> I also got this pencil from Desai. It's, um, it's, it has a lighter, uh, you know, when you write, it's not as dark. I don't remember what that's called. And then, uh, so I tried that. It was like a dollar fifty or something. I bought this rubber cement pickup. It's like, uh, hold on here, let me, I could rip it, but I don't really feel like ripping it. Cut that open. Tape, wow, I cut my hand off. Um, it's like this funny rubber. And I thought I could use that because I have this stuff. It's called um, uh, masking tape. So it's like, a, it's like a liquid that you paint onto your and it dries and then you can paint over and then wipe it off so that you it stays white behind it so you can do detail so if you're doing like let's say wheat so you would paint this on the wheat that you drew or and then it dries and you paint over it like a dark back sky or whatever and then you wipe it off and then all you have left is the wheat the white so you can do detail in that um, and this is what I want to use to wipe it off instead of just my finger and possibly smudging but I'm going to try it for what it's actually made for it's, it's the leftovers of your pencil graphite whatever rubber cement I'm not really sure anyway <clears throat> but it was like three dollars so I thought I'll try to get it anyway because I would use it for that glue stuff I also got myself a eraser um that uh I'm excited to try try not murder myself with this knife and this was $5 and it has a small end. I almost bought the bag that has like three other of these erasers in it, but I was like, oh my God, you're spending 50 bucks. So I might as well use this. See if I like it, which I feel like I do. I will see if I like it and then, um, and go get more if I need more. So I always have the tendency, the tendency to like, um, want to like buy everything and back up so then i thought i would show you this is my first time using this so i have this little empty tin it's still dirty but i didn't clean it because uh, ain't nobody got time for that i'm gonna zoom in here zoom in and then i'm gonna fill it up right now just because it's my first time and i want you to experience it with me look at this beautiful red so I'm going to squeeze it in the bottom, squeeze it until it's nice and full. Oh, that's a pretty red. Now, I'm very excited about that. Wipe this off. I don't want to waste any. But honestly, this just the rim of that would probably do like a lot on a painting. Now, I'm going to use another paintbrush that I had. Um, I'm going to write Crimson Hue. Crimson Hue, that's a nice light color. I'm pushing hard, but I... Win, winds are red deep. I'll just write red deep. Okay, I already like that pencil. Um, I don't know why I didn't write it up higher here. <laughs> I suppose I'll try my new eraser. Ooh. Yep, I like the eraser. It's more. It's not for big areas like that. It's for... Here, I'll write gently red deep. All right, I'm going to show you the crimson, this, the crimson hue. I thought it was crimson red, but it's not the same. I'm going right in there, and I'm going to show you. See, it's kind of have a, kind of has a pink color. Go right in there more, get it darker. 
is dark. So I'm going to get it. Okay, it's pretty color, but it has a lot of pink in there. Now I'm going to wash off my brush, <clears throat> make circles, and I'm going to grab a little bit of this red. This is the dark hue. And I'm going to mix it in with some water. And I will. This is much, this is not showing the best color quality, I feel. And water that down a bit. And like, so get right into the red. Yeah, that's the red that I was looking for. So look at, hmm. It's hard to tell. <laughs> it's kind of similar, but I can see it. It's like a deep red, Christmas red, and this one is orangey pinky. It's pinky more in real life, but I really like this one. <clears throat> it's not really showing the right color. It's annoying. I could see it differently in real life. Anyway, that's that's it. I'm really excited about this. Um, my new purchases. So now I gotta start painting stuff so I'm not going in debt. Okay, have a good day. Peace out. <laughs>